first step in faith. You don't have to see the whole staircase, just the first. Hey, you guys, it's me, your fave G, and I am back with another one. Happy Monday, happy MLK Day. Those words came straight from MLK himself. I love listening to his speakings because y'all, they're so motivating. If you have never engaged and went on YouTube or went to, got some type of motivation from Dr. Martin Luther King speakings, y'all go do it because I'm telling y'all, it motivates you, it motivates you. And this was perfect for this video because on today I am gonna be talking to you guys about the power of hustling. When you're a small business owner, when you're a big business owner, when you're just starting your social media content creation, whatever it is that you wanna do, we're gonna talk about the power of hustling. And what you have to do first, is take the first step. Welcome if you are new, welcome back if you are not. I am your girl G with the gems and over here, we talk about all things life changing. We talk about budgeting, business, saving, money management, finances, any and everything that can change your life, we discuss it here over on the channel. So if you have not already, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and smash that notification bell because y'all don't wanna miss this here. Y'all, it is MLK Day. I love listening to Dr. Martin Luther King speakings, and that was one of his speakings that came that I just uh, said on my first video. Just take the first step. If you have not, just take the first step. The first step is all you need to take. Don't look at the staircase, only the first step. Y'all, I promise, if we can start just taking that first step, if we just can start initiating that walk, Everything else will be like a breeze. Everything else will be so light, you guys. I promise you. Listen, this here is for all my small business owners, my big business owners, my entrepreneurs, the people that just want to start and is afraid to, not even afraid to, just keeps getting derailed. I know because I am there. Like I am literally walking in the beginning of stages of success. So I choose to show and share everything with you guys because y'all, it's possible. Whatever it is that you want to do, it is possible. As long as you put your mind to it and just do it. I'm giving y'all some Monday motivation on today. Y'all going to see a lot of these. I love listening to motivational videos. I love listening to motivational podcasts, any and everything that can uplift me in my business, in my entrepreneurship walk, everything, anything with my social media content creation. If it can uplift me, I'm listening to it. I'm walking around with my AirPods on every day all day because i'm listening to something positive i told y'all in my last video we're getting rid of the negative in 2024 we are not engaging with those who cannot bring us up or help us evolve okay so if that's stuff that you like make sure to like comment and subscribe smash that notification bell <laughs> all right guys so i'm gonna just get right on into this video because i know this here is well needed in our community a lot of us is just starting from the ground up and we literally starting with nothing I know that when you have a small business or when you're on your entrepreneurship journey that you don't have too many resources to reach out to, right? Like too much money because a lot of people who start these e-commerce business who start from the ground up, we need money. We need resources and it gets kind of discouraging because you're like, man, I want to do this. I want to invest this into my business, but I, everything that I'm getting from my business, I'm pouring back into it. So I'm literally left with nothing. My first year in business, I ended it with, I can't even, that's how tight it was because I can't even see the camera, <laughs> literally nothing. But I want you to understand, do not get discouraged. Do not, do not get discouraged because these things happen in business. I read somewhere where they said that the first year in business is the toughest year because you're going to inquire the most loss. Don't panic, y'all. You just got to keep hustling. You just got to keep going because I promise you the end result is so much more worth it, okay? All right, so let's just jump right on into this video. I'm talking to you guys on today about the power of hustling. You have to hustle when you're first starting off a business, when you're going through the stages of uh, marketing, campaigning, sending off emails, making sure you're in contact with the correct people, doing pop-up shops, um, when it comes down to content creation, making sure you're uploading at the certain time, making sure you're posting at the right time, making sure your content is sufficient and it's growing and it's helping other people. Everything is consuming. Trust me, I know. <laughs> 
That's why I want to make this channel because I want people to see the realisticness of it. Y'all, it is very much time consuming. It is very much draining. It takes a lot of energy, but you have to keep hustling. If you post something and you only get one view, if you put something up for sale and you only get one sale, appreciate it because remember, that one sale was not where it was. Not what it could have been if you wouldn't have started, okay? So appreciate that one sale. Appreciate that one view. If that video is up two weeks and it only gets 200 views, that's fine because you never know over the course of time where it can go. Listen, my first video did not hit until two months after posting it. When I very first went viral, that video did not hit and jump in numbers until two months after posting it, y'all. And my page then went viral over on Instagram, right? On YouTube, my YouTube did not get monetized until right before my interview with Monique, I had been doing YouTube for a whole year, literally a whole year. I was at my wit's end. I was like, you know what? I'm tired. I am tired. I do not want to post no more. <laughs> I was like, these people are not seeing me. I'm getting 100 views. If you scroll back down on my videos, you'll see I was getting 50 views, 20 views. I'm like, man, what? The but you have to be patient and you have to await the process. Keep posting. Keep posting, keep recording content, keep making those videos because I promise you it's going to blow. You have to keep hustling. You cannot give up when it gets tough. I'm telling you, business owners, entrepreneurs, bosses, you cannot give up when it starts to get tough because the toughness is what builds the muscle, right? Right? Those tough times is what's building that muscle and making you want it even more so you know i'm going through this right now but i promise i know i can see the end of the tunnel i know i can see the end of the rainbow i'm gonna keep working because i can see what is gonna happen let me tell y'all what i used to do i literally will watch everybody else content everybody else uh progresses like everybody like even when it came down to buying a home i would watch videos with people just buy a home and be so happy for these people knowing i'm nowhere near where i need to be at to purchase a home <laughs> like literally y'all that was me i used to be so happy for others and i would pour so much back into others where the glory came back to me just like that like everything has just been progressing in life i always pour back into others so y'all it's week three of 2024 we are in week three of 2024. You have to tell me something that you have decided. You cannot tell me, man, I want to do it. Man, I need to do it. Man, I want to do it, but I'm just not self-motivated. Listen, listen, self-motivation is just that self. You have to motivate yourself. I can get in front of the camera. You can watch all these big YouTubers and big influencers, and they can motivate you and motivate you and motivate you, and you still don't get it. You have to turn that self-motivation up. You have to level it all the way up, put the volume all the way on high, and you have to just go. Put the feet on the, the your foot on the gas and just go with self-motivation. Because I promise you, once you get that self-motivation, y'all, me and one of my best friends, me and my best friend, I'm saying one of my best friends, me and my best friend was just talking, and we were talking about that. We were talking about that, just going and just doing it because that's what God just wants us to do. He just wants us to take that step, take that leap out of faith, and just do it. Whatever it is that you want to do, just do it. I'm not telling nobody to go and quit their job, I'm not telling nobody to go and give their two week notice. I'm not telling you that. I have a video coming up about that too. So make sure y'all tune in. But I'm not telling nobody that. I'm just telling you to stop the procrastination when it comes down to the things that you want in life, the things that you desire, the things that is for you. Stop the procrastination, y'all. Put your foot on the gas and go. Because I promise once that self-motivation is you ain't going to stop. You just going to keep going and going and going. Once you get a little taste of it and it's good, you're like, oh, yeah, let me keep going. Let me keep going. Even when the bucks come, oh, I'm dodging. Let me keep going. Let me keep coming. <laughs> I'm telling y'all, y'all, it'll feel so good. So make sure you keep hustling. Make sure you keep going. Make sure you keep putting your foot on the gas all 2024. I don't care if it takes you a whole year. Some people, it takes 30 days. Some people, it takes 60 days. Some people, it takes six months. I tell all my clients that with credit repair, don't come up in here expecting results that a friend sent you that they had. Everybody's different. Every channel is different. Every business is different. Everything happens according to his timing anyway. So just keep doing it because guess what? Guess what? What if it works? What if it works? What if it works, y'all? 
We're not thinking about what if it don't work. We're thinking about what if it work. It's going, it's, it's going to blow your mind, literally, okay? Literally blow your mind. So make sure you keep hustling. What's your goal for 2024? I need to know it. I need you to drop down in the comments right now. Your goal, if it's a business goal, if it's a personal goal, what is your goal for 2024? Because I have a question coming behind it. What have you done so far to start working towards that goal? If it's home buying, did you ever pull your credit up? Did you ever go to Experian.com? They're giving you your three credit reports for free on Experian.com. Have you pulled your credit up? Do you Have you analyzed your credit? Do you know exactly what you need to do to go towards purchasing a home? Have you talked to somebody? Have you talked to a realtor? Have you talked to a lender to see what you need to do? Stop sitting back saying, I want to purchase a home. I want to purchase a home. Okay, what are you doing to do it? What are you doing? Listen, I don't use car a lot because I feel like cars depreciate. So I don't, I don't, I don't do that too much. I feel like cars depreciate. I promise I still have my 2017 Acura, y'all. I'm telling you, look, I'm not big on cars. So I'm going to be real honest with you. But if, if it's a car that you want, what have you done to work towards it? Have you started working on your credit? If it's a business that you're trying to build, what have you done? Even if you don't have the money, you can get online and start working towards whatever it is that you're trying to sell for free. There are so many free resources right here on the internet. YouTube University will tell you it all for free. So there's no excuse why you shouldn't be pushing towards whatever goal it is because we are in week three. Week three of 2024. And if you sit where you are and you don't start now, if you don't push the hustling, if you don't push the hustling now, I promise you won't start. You got to keep going, y'all. You got to keep going. That's all I got for y'all on today. I need y'all to start hustling. I need y'all to start pushing. I need y'all to start moving. I need you to get your motivation up. That self-motivation is key. You need to start that now. Take those negative thoughts out your mind. I have a video that I posted that eight tips to success, y'all. It's really good. I'm going to have it linked down below. Y'all go check that video out. I'm telling you, if you start implementing these little bitty keys, it's going to work. It has no object but to work. But if you don't start, you're still going to be sitting where you are in 2025. You have to go. I need you to put your foot on the gas. I'm sitting here pressing my foot. Y'all can't see it. But I'm pressing my foot because your foot got to go on the gas. Because you got to start. You have to start. You cannot keep sitting around saying, I'm going to do it. I want to open this business. But I'm going to do it. I'm going to do this. Let me tell you something. A wise man once told me, it was a doctor that I worked for. He was an IT supervisor for years. And his wife was pushing him to go to college to become a doctor. And he was like, I don't want to go to no college to become a doctor. That's going to take too long. I don't have six to eight years to waste. I don't want... And his wife looked at him and said, but in six to eight years, what are you going to be doing? Exactly what you're doing today. Come on now. Come on. If you don't start today... January 1st of 2025, what are you going to be doing? Exactly what you was doing in 24, exactly what you were doing in 23, exactly what you were doing in 22, exactly what you were doing in 21. You have to start the hustle now. You have to start the self-motivation now. Because if you don't, you won't. Period. What is that? <laughs> I'm your girl G with the gyms and I am always back with another one. I love y'all so much. I got to get going because what I didn't tell y'all, I got to get this hustle on with my weight loss because I got to get myself back in shape. <laughs> Look, the thyroids take me past y'all. I be trying to. I really do. I be trying to, but I'm like, oh, I didn't put on an extra lot of weight. And I'm like, man, I know I look good and stuff, but I need this because I ain't never had this much on me. I need it gone. So my hustle this year on top of my business is working towards my health and my fitness because I have to be here to see my kids get older, to see them have kids, to see their kids have kids. So I have to get my health in order. So I'm on my way to the gym. I'm going to let y'all go on this Monday. I hope y'all have a prosperous week. I hope that you guys succeed in whatever it is that you want to do on this week. My prayer is that each and every person that watches this video prospers. I love y'all so much. And until next time, we over here building generational wealth and breaking those generational curses. Bye, y'all.